Hello everyone, welcome to Horses by Hula Chowdown with your host, Hula Chowdown. Today I have a bunch of unboxings to do, so pretty much just we're going to get on with that. If that's something you're interested in, I'll stop waving the scissors around because I feel like that's dangerous, but if you're interested in unboxings, you should subscribe because there's going to be a whole lot of unboxings going on in the next week, two weeks, probably month. I don't know. I've got a lot of boxes for whatever reason this month and I'm okay with it. Without further ado, let's do the Petit Vore unboxing. So, we're going to be unboxing the Petit Vor box today. I haven't opened it, so I'm completely going to be surprised when I open it like you guys are. Oh, they're so sweet. They always give like these beautiful cards with what everything is. Isn't that lovely? So the first thing I grab is a lengthening organic mascara from Harvest Natural Beauty. And it's black. It is all natural, certified, organic, sustainably formulated, vegan, gluten-free, and cruelty-free. So, it's smudge-proof and water-resistant. That's pretty great. I always love trying new mascaras, so we'll see how that goes. And then the next thing I have is Petite Histoire New York, Envie de Soir. So it's just like a natural perfume. So that's pretty great. And yeah, it's just like a natural perfume sample. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, next we have, oh, this I've tried this before. This is great. Um, it's from Juice Beauty and it's the Blemish Clearing Serum. So yeah, I've tried this before and it's really good. So I'm kind of excited to get it again. Um, next, I have the Derme Essentials Radiance Toner. It is glycolic acid and rubios. It's a just a toner. It's alcohol free. It's cruelty free. That's awesome. See, it's got the little bunny. A little bunny. So this is what the bottle looks like. It's just like a little sample size toner so that's pretty great i really actually enjoy sample size because if i don't like it i don't want the whole thing but if i like it it's perfect because it's just enough that you can really try it and then you can choose to buy more or you can choose to keep trying other things you know because there's so many great brands in the world so i tend not to really want to I don't know, like limit myself, like I, unless I find something that I really truly love, you know. And the last thing I have is Pa Akai Cleansing Cream. I'm sorry, I, I don't know how to say that word. Oh, it's from Hawaii, so yeah. I, I don't speak Hawaiian, unfortunately. I'm sorry if that's not what it's called. I just call it that because I don't know any better. Um, but yeah, so it's just like a little cleansing cream. So that's kind of cool. Uh, it's made with Hawaiian salts, hibiscus, seaweed, 
and it's to cleanse, repair, renew for soft, hydrated skin. So, yeah, that's it in the box. So, you know, I think that's that's a pretty good box, you know, for a very inexpensive box. Like, you tend to really get products that are nicely curated, but also very on point with the brand. And I do believe the brand is like natural, cruelty-free kind of things. I don't know if it's cruelty-free 100%, but I feel like it's, it's basically just like not like healthy clean natural products so yeah let's see how much this this box was worth so they say that the mascara is 18 dollars i can see that um the cleansing cream was 12 yeah fair so that's 30 dollars so far the Radiance Toner is $2.50. The Blemish Clearing Serum is $15. And the, the Perfume is 5 So in total, this is like $42 worth. I think that's, that's very, that's very good for this cute little box. You know, like, look how cute that is. And it's just like in this nice little box, like minimalist packaging, not like some where you get like this giant box for like two things. I mean, I guess they could, I don't know, in theory, I don't know. I think this is okay because you can use these boxes. Like I actually keep most of them and put stuff in them. And then like you just label what it is and they're nice dirty boxes so i mean you can't be too unhappy with that it's pretty pretty decent box for for the price so yeah be bold be kind petit vous i don't know i think it's a cute box i definitely enjoy this one you know it's just, it's sweet, you know, it's, it's very sweet. Also, Miles was kind enough to leave so I can use his little cot. I guess it's really a couch, but he uses it as a bed. So he has all of these pillows and buddies because he's a spoiled dog. But yeah, that's why I'm sitting here because he is not in the room right now otherwise he would be probably right here and very mad that i was taking his space but anyways if you like this you feel free to like or dislike if you didn't like it i mean fair enough you can do that that's within your rights you can do it um and leave a comment hopefully about something maybe what would what's your favorite thing in this box you know i think my favorite thing is probably gonna be the mascara just because i love mascaras like i love trying new ones so that's my favorite what's your favorite please comment down below and um don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell icon because otherwise you won't know when i put up all my videos and I'm probably going to be putting up more than, than two a week because I've got a fair bit of boxes i got to get through. So I might be doing like three or four. I don't know. It, but it's my, my normal schedule is Monday and Friday. So you might be getting more than that. You might not. It depends on kind of just how many videos I end up making. So, yeah, I think that's it. Um, yeah. You do you. You're amazing. And thank you for watching. I appreciate you spending your time with me and watching me open boxes because, you know, 
not everyone does. And if you're still watching this, you're awesome. You really are. You deserve this emoji. This is your emoji if you're still watching. <laughs>